what is happening YouTube welcome back to this channel this is how to do stop motion using iMovie in your iPad let's get started all right just a quick reminder about stop motion it happens when you have camera set at one point and you have an object moving in the scene and you snap pictures of that object it looks like a movie when you put them all together anyways you get into iMovie um, you load up your theme Theme doesn't really matter in this anyways, because we're going to get rid of that effect anyways. Um, so you get your pictures, load them up to your timeline. This process might take a bit longer, so I will just fast forward through this anyways, and I'll come back and tell you the next step right after. Uh, there is one more thing that I need to explain to you guys before I move on. There's something called Ken Burns effect. This represents the action of the camera when it zooms into one part of the clip just to make it look non-boring. It's out there in every kind of video editor. Um, so iMovie has that as well. Now, I don't want my clip to be moving for stop motion. So there are three steps. The first one would be get rid of that Ken Burns effect. The second one would be transition. Transition makes the camera move as well. And then the third one is actually making the clip short as much as possible. So instead of having it on the screen for like three seconds or four seconds, whatever the default is, we're going to make it as short as possible. To make it as short, we're going to get rid of transition and Ken Burns effect. And I'll quickly go through with this and I'll come back for the next one. All right, so the next step that we have is that we're gonna have to get rid of some more side effects of having either the Ken Burn or the transitional effect, I'm not sure. Uh, so the pictures are randomly placed on the screen at the moment. We're gonna have to align them all at one point in the screen. So what I'm doing is I'm having right bottom corner of each picture and using that as the center point. Um, and just getting that all set up throughout the clip right after doing that this clip is all done but we need to increase the speed to make it look smoother iMovie unfortunately does not have speed up button at the moment they might have it on um, hopefully next update or something what you can do is you can upload your video on YouTube and use the YouTube studio and there is a speed up button for that and this will make your clip look smoother than that and that is all for today and if you guys have any comments, leave it down below. Uh, please hit that like button and subscribe for more. And I will see you guys in the next one.